Hey guys, we're time six. We're here continuing the series You on Netflix. This is something we started a while back on our channel. We're finally picking it up. Gonna watch the whole series, season one and two, and season three when that comes out. So we will be doing early access and full reactions for the series. Check out our Patreon for that. Four episodes in advance. Get that right now. Don't miss out. You should like, comment, and subscribe. Hit the bell icon so you're notified as soon as we upload the second episode. I mean the third episode because we're on episode two. So this is episode two called The Last Nice Guy in New York. And let's get started right away. Tonight's the night, Dad. My first date. It just feels right, right? This guy is zooped. <laughs> what the fuck is he doing? <laughs> yo, he's too amped, yo. This guy is creepy. Sure. UFT? <laughs> they all look at UFT. Yeah. Yo, this guy is so touchy. Nothing is not up to both of them. Come. This guy just do nothing all day. He just follows her everywhere. Yeah, like, go to work, yo. Oh, there, there you, you go. go. <laughs> hey, they came for the big day. You want me to move them down to the basement? No, I'll do that. Let's get started on the window display. Hi, Joe. What are you reading? This book about werewolves that goes Isn't in the Isn't that the kid from God of War? It's more about love stuff. Kind of, yeah. It looks exactly like him. Kind of, yeah, yeah, you're right. There's... Should be... Right. Could be him though, right? Bro, look at his face. Yeah. Right. They use yeah, real people in games nowadays, so... Yeah. Look at that face. That's, yeah. yeah. That's him. Yeah, the monster That's the boy. Is really cool. Uh... You... Now you have to kill him. Oh shit! Oh. Now you have to kill him. Power of human memory. She's not my girlfriend. You can have her. Take her. Careful, Benji. Not winning any points. The spark. So you tell me if you're too distracted, Becca. You decide. Sure. Looking forward. Pretty epic. At six? Time six? <laughs> what about your job? Bookstore manager or or international super spy? It's just... I mean, is that your goal? <clears throat> or... I know I'm in a city full of people with, with, with big fat neon sign aspirations. And I know it's not cool to say and it's not big and flashy. But I love books. And I want my life to... Be about what I actually love. Damn, she's feeling it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Look at the hair twirl. Twirling the hair, yeah. yeah. Jeez. <laughs> she's all about it, yo. Yeah, yeah, what's she thinking about? She's gonna pine him. You're looking a little gray and mealy in there. Oh, shit, you stole my stack. Thought it wasn't for you. <laughs> right. You happy? It's mine. I'm a chipper. I never do it more than three days a week. I'm quitting. I'm quitting, man. Only if you're quitting. She's branded the living shit out of herself across the internet. Oh. I want you to know, if I wasn't about to be late to see you, I would beat this guy. Bloody Wait, is he speaking facts? Is she actually fucked up? I'm telling you, this is her thing. Yeah, I feel like you would know, right? She's got a red lipstick, and she's getting ready to work her professor hard for that ass. Jeez. <laughs> I'll see you later, Ben. <laughs> I think that's what he's implying. <clears throat> Oh! Oh shit! He's creepy too. <laughs> Yo, everyone's fucked on this show. Wow! Right. Jeez! I like you. The 
What would y'all buy? It's on right. Release you from the. Damn, this guy's yo, this guy's manipulative, yo. <clears throat> Damn. Jeez. Your right to be angry. He's Something next to be locked up. Just be allowed. <laughs> In Joel's dungeon. Yeah, yo, he's next. <gasps> oh, that's easy. Us in 30 years. Whoa. Yo, this, this guy's reaching. This moves. This guy's reaching right now. I love that. I mean, you could play that off as a joke, but still. I guess, yeah. It's, it's too early for those type of talks, you know? Yeah. Uh, Way too early. Talks as ever. <laughs> hey, you play it off as a joke. Mm-hmm. This guy's good, man. He has the moves, yo. To be honest, starting to think I'm some kind of magnet for, like, dudes with serious issues. Yeah. You don't say that. The biggest, biggest one right there. <laughs> Fuck. I don't know. Oh shit, oh! Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Oh! Damn, bro. He's about to see some pretty bad things. Why is this kid uh, always in Yo! Oh nah. shit. That was creepy. Yeah, that's yo. That was hella creepy, eh? That's some red flags, even as a kid. Yeah, you, you should be like, wait, what the fuck? Nah. You, you yeah, yeah, you nah, would. Bro. Just I told you on the way, you didn't see bro, his the way he was though. acting, bro. Yeah, his acting was like, so, like crazy, right? Mm-hmm. One, two, or three. Oh, oh shit. Oh, shit. I don't know. They were all he has, weren't they? They were all Yeah, exactly. Oh, oh shit. <laughs> oh, soda is, obviously. <laughs> Jeez. Guy played him. She does not want to be with a guy like you. What? I can help you. No, actually, she invited me to a party tonight. The Peach Salinger's. It's a Salinger party. Oh, Joe. She's, she's taking you to add texture. She wants to seem interesting, like she hangs out with real folk. <clears throat> she's deep. She's an artist. Truth, Beck will always leave someone like you for someone who can take her places. She's just a player, just like him. I think what he's saying is all true, and he's gonna have to realize it at some point. Yeah. Then he's gonna kidnap her. No, then he turns on her. She showed you her nails. She's got this red kitchen label. It's a whole call you daddy spanking thing. She's taking a shit. With me, because I'm loaded, not you, because so are you. Well, hopefully nothing gastrointestinal happens, but I do hope you guys like each other. You want to change that? Oh. Damn, they're gonna work together. Is that what I'm seeing? Is that the plan? Shit. Oh, he knows it's true now. Yeah, he does. Cause she just went in without this that's him as a kid. A full set. Each one of them is worth three times as much for a collector. You read that one? What's the first one? Typical. Oh, oh, oh damn! I need some illiterate working in my shop. Yo, hey, that's why it makes so much sense. You learn the value of these books. He was abused. Move, please. Everything you need is in there. I- Joe, this is Joe. This is a lovely collection, Peaches. Peaches. <laughs> Peaches. <laughs> Good salesman has to know his product, right? Thank goodness for you. I mean, she's trying to see his stalker. Of all places, at the very right moment. Oh, see, yeah. Uh, oh, she's on to him. She's like, yo, you're stalking. I'm guessing that yours are pretty sharp. Wow. <laughs> well played. That's the movements. Oh, oh, Should oh. Should we go for another drink or another kiss? <laughs> now it's happening. Oh, what the <laughs> fuck was that? I knew it. <laughs> Bro, I knew it. Hey, oh. glad we're friends? I knew it. <laughs> I told you guys. Drunk. Glad we're friends. Drunk and <laughs> friend zone. I told you guys that. Wow. Maddie, that's crazy. It's so good to see you. Um, this is Beck. Hey. 
Hey. So, I heard about you and Candace. So why are you gonna bring well, stuff like that? Happy. <laughs> I like... thought she could be happy. Yeah. With some guy in Rome, so you know, I guess she's following her bliss. Just how she left so suddenly? How much does she know? Everyone's so stuff. I always felt like that needed to be over. Wait, did this guy kill her, yo? Or kidnap oh, her or something? Oh. Yeah, what the fuck? E. So he's not really a psychopath. He's a sociopath. Sociopaths can develop uh, relationships with people. Feelings? Yeah, but they're still like fucked up. Uh. Psychopaths just like no feelings. All the bathrooms in the building have the same kind of ceiling, so go in the bathroom. The ceiling tiles around the vent move if you push them, so you push one, pop a book in there, slide it closed. Like if you pretend like Benji, that's right. Benji. <laughs> <laughs> that was funny. Man, I forgot about Benji. Yo. No, the way he got up too. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Withdrawals? I guess I'm realizing I have no choice. Is she giving in? But to share this. Oh. Huh? This guy's like, what? Exposed? Well, it can fit in one tweet. A list of six women who have a story about you. Not oh. much asking around. What's the term again? Harassment or misconduct? Anyway, they were too scared to come forward, but then we realized it's harder to dismiss seven women with the same story. Jeez. That's not possible. And she's a that's writer, too. Inappropriate. You want to make yourself a public flyer? That actually would sink your career. Blackmail is not something you live down. Damn, this guy's ready, yo. You're trying to call my bluff, but I'm not bluffing. Oh. So she came with another statement. Oh. Damn, Benji killed Can I man. Tell you something. And once I tell you, I'll know your worst secret. And then all mine. And you can let me go. That's a deal? Depends what the secret is. <laughs> a lot of interesting stuff in Benji's nice room. They all stood there. What? what? They killed him? The fuck? And oh shit. Was the worst because he they, stood they made him there jump? holding the camera. Oh shit, he drowned. It's a little bonding moment, eh? Oh, oh shit. Damn. He made it. She was waiting for him to eat a donut. His breath stank. <laughs> Out of the friend zone. He made it, yo. Come back. Oh, <laughs> jeez! In the middle of the broad daylight, while this during store hours. Or just like a line behind her. This guy's in love, eh? Is he? Man's in love right now. Or is he in love with the idea of love? It's too deep, yo. <laughs> See, I, I can't think it? that deep right now. <laughs> <laughs> like, like, you know. That's for the discussion. Like you said, I'm not a killer. Did he poison that? It's about her. Oh shit. He looked he at the drink. Her. Why did he look at the drink? I think he poisoned oh. it. He poisoned it? I think I was scared of what you would do to her. Oh shit. Oh shit. He is they a killer now. Her. Damn, bro. Two tablespoons of peanut oil. Oh peanut! Oh, oh shit. He's having a super Oh that's what anaphylactic. He did. Man gave him a deadly allergic re reaction. Who knew? The peanut allergy was real. Yo, Damn. This show is so sick. <laughs> it got pretty sick, so. Uh, if you let him go, that would have been like, nah, get the fuck out of here. Yeah, no, that's, that's <laughs> a loose end. Yeah, I, it's a loose end, right? I wouldn't say I like it, but the better option was killing him. Yeah. 
That would have went to like a whole. Other I mean, story. he never should have kidnapped him in the first place. But now that you're there, you have to kill him, right? No, was it garbage in? Toss it. Oh, oh yeah, my, that happened to my straw too. Yo. Yeah, that's one thing. I know about, that's why. I, that's I, one thing about paper straws, right? It's like you can't like just chill nope. and sip. Like, I have to take it off and just drink like this. I know that's why I, I was gonna keep doing it. And once I saw you said fuck it, I was like, yo, fuck it. I know. Um, so yeah, no, there's a lot to discuss here. A lot of shit. This show is so deep, yo. <clears throat> really deep. Mm-hmm. Is it about love or is it about him being in love? There's a lot of analyzing. You know. <laughs> uh. So yo, actually, yo, let's get into that discussion then, because it seems like from his narration, he he's more interested in the idea of being in a relationship than actually than being. actually like. Pursuing being in a relationship yeah. because being in a relationship it's all staged no because being in an actual relationship you actually have to naturally find out about the person mm-hmm. like who this person is if you're even a match but he assumed that before he was yeah. ever with her right and that's where I think Benji's perspective of, her, of hers comes in right because mm-hmm. let's say that what uh, Joe said in the end was true that she was only this way because of what you did Mm-hmm. I think there's still a hint of what he said, which is truth, which is gonna come out later, which he's ignoring right now because he's in his own fantasy. No, world, definitely, right? definitely, I think it's gonna come out, right? Yeah, but um, it it kind of works out too, cause like it's hard to say, right? Cause you never know, cause um, what what he she's experiencing here is like some sort of like bonding moment that I guess she never had with Benji and whatnot, cause they had they had money. There, oh, yeah. No, I'm not saying yeah. that her feelings can't be sincere about Joe. Mm-hmm. But I think, like... Like, she might just go get a next guy. No, there's some like, character traits that yeah. are always going to be within your personality, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah Even yeah, yeah, if yeah. something else comes up higher, like your feelings for someone, that underlying mm-hmm. thing is always going to be there, if that's the case. So mm-hmm. if Benji's telling the truth, that's always going to be there. If something happens, in the, let's say they get in the fight, mm-hmm. feelings go down, something else comes up, makes her make a stupid decision, right? Mm-hmm. And then... I also think it's because of her friends too. Because yeah. all of her friends are rich, right? That yeah. one brown girl, Peach. Peaches. But aren't her friends like, are there other friends rich? Yeah, yeah all the, the Asian rich? one. The Asian one. The Asian one, like the She's dad's rich. a CEO of something. Mom's yeah. like a, a CEO of a pharmaceutical company. I think mom's a surgeon. Yeah. She's the only one. That other like, one, both parents also So it's like she's, she strives to get to that like level of life, but she can't, right? Oh, so yo, then what, her friends. So yo, what Benji is saying is true then. She thinks that mm-hmm. if she surrounds herself with this company... She'll yeah. be elevated. Definitely, yeah. So, Benji is saying the truth. But that no? is... Yeah, he is saying the truth. I, I, I really uh, think that, too. Well, that, that still doesn't make him right, though. Fucking... No, for what Joe. he's doing to her in the relationship, obviously he's wrong for that. Yeah. But that doesn't mean... No, he no, can't no Joe, right. Joe. So not Benji. Oh, no, oh, okay. yeah. Joe, but one yeah. thing is that she... But she seems hesitant to hang out with them sometimes, too. Like, remember when they said, like, oh, let's go check out the new bar in Soho That's or whatever? That's because... She's not compatible with them. She's only with them because of the elevation in, uh, exactly. in status, mm, right? Yeah. Because so if she was actually friends with them, she wouldn't like. You wouldn't have those scenes where she just has like a uncomfortable yeah. look, right? Yeah. Like she would be vibing with them like way better. Yeah. You know, it seems as if a lot of girls go through this in real life too. You know, take I'm a lot sure of rich yeah. guys and shit. Yeah. And you know, this sure. also goes to show it's not always about being a gold dick. It's not like about being in a relationship. Just yeah. your friends too, like who you hang out with. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It could also come from that angle, right? Yeah. But Joe's still fucked up though. Yeah, he's let's like, talk about Joe. Yo. Joe he's is over a... here just like plotting each move, right? He's like, oh, if I do this, she's going to do that. You know what I'm trying to say? Yeah. Like he's just he's just forcefully putting himself in that position. Like. That's what I'm saying. Like like I said before, he's just... Yeah. He's, he's in love with the idea of love, right? Yeah, he's You're planning right. how the relationship is going to proceed rather than... Partaking in the relationship From what I I see so far Right Yeah And that's not how you Like Like there was that one line He's like oh this is how our story starts Back Or whatever The mm-hmm. fuck he said It's like no That's not how our story starts Like a story has to start naturally and Yeah like, like Yo I don't know man it's No but like yo I It's mean, complicated yo I mean I guess if like You're that guy Like that would play girls and shit You would like anticipate Okay yo let me go talk to this girl She might say this Maybe I can land, you know, a day with her, right? The people naturally okay, do that. Okay, yeah, so I guess in every situation, you know? like, But like, he's not looking for that. He's not looking to yeah. have sex quickly or play girls. Like, he's looking for, like, a relationship. 
and he's forcefully trying to develop these feelings and oh, no, what you said bonding is, movements. Yeah, you what know? you said is really true. Even normal people, mm-hmm. girl or guy, like like we all plan out our, our stuff like to some extent, right? Yeah. It's like, oh, like I'm going to go talk to this girl. This is going to be my opening line. Mm-hmm. And then we'll go from there, right? Like that's how much you plan. Yeah. Like you're not going to plan like anything more than that, yeah. right? We're not going to fucking kidnap her ex-boyfriend. Or like. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this guy. I still think that was a huge mistake, yo. Super huge mistake. Yo, also, like, whatever that, uh, whoever Candace was, or... Oh, yeah, the ex. So what do you think happened there? Did she kidnap him, or... He kidnapped he her? He kidnapped her. And killed her? Yeah, because she, cause she said the, she the, went missing. Yeah, something suspicious. She, she didn't Did say, she say missing, missing. She, she said, said she up left. and left, like, really Yeah, she suddenly. up and left. She just suddenly. left. So that just obviously means that she never had a farewell to any of her friends, including Joe. So I'm guessing like... Well, she shouldn't say that she was gone. She said she left. Yeah. yeah. She didn't say she was dead or anything. I mean, some girls do just Well, leave, she like, said she got up and left. So we can't assume that she's still there. What if she just... What no, if, I like, feel like her friends... No, what if it was keep... made to look like she left? Because uh, I don't yeah. know if it was a literal, like he, like... he said the thing about some shit in Rome. Yeah. That was either a metaphor of like some prince in Rome. Or it was literal. She went to a different country, right? Yeah. Mm. And if that's the case, then she left. It's like, what if I just leave here? Stop coming over here, you know? I mean, we we have your number. <laughs> I know, but like, what if and I don't? We'll drag your ass back here. <laughs> if I don't fucking like call you guys and shit, you know, it's we'll kind of weird, you, right? We'll like, find you. no, we'll find you. We'll we'll kidnap you, like Benji. We'll yo, yeah, exactly. You gotta fucking react, okay? Next time you come in here, we'll be <laughs> closed off. Me up, one sure. entrance, one exit. <laughs> soundproof. Uh, Look, yeah. he's, Akil's already doing the soundproofing. Yeah. So yo, now I think he's gonna go into like the serial killer aspect because that's his first serial body. Killer. Oh, that's his first so, yeah, body. If this is his first body. Then he didn't kill Candace. Yeah, I mean we we're just assuming. Who knows, right? But no, I think Benji was onto something. Like he he's not a killer, but this is his first kill, probably. Yeah. Right. Yeah. And then once you have yeah. your first kill, if you're even a sociopath, like, even the way he was talking is like like even his like internal his monologue. It was like yeah, yeah if I was a killer, it should be way easier. Yeah. So now he's gonna probably kidnap the professor or some shit. Yeah, it's like you, <laughs> after your first kill, if you're a sociopath, you're gonna keep that doing is. it, right? Yeah. You're so gonna he, kill the professor. Going to street. Then he's gonna kill Peach. Yeah. And, and it's for anyone else that comes in the way. It's for that same person too. Yeah. Damn. Wait up, what do I want to do real quick? It's gonna get wild. It's because I always mix up sociopath and psychopath. No, you're right. I was right? That sociopaths can develop relationships, right? Yeah. The psychopaths can? Yeah, yeah okay. Mm. Yo, do they put coffee in the ice? Look how there's like white shit inside. No, it just melts into it, right? Really? How do you put coffee in the ice, Kyle? I don't, bro, look at it. How does that make sense? No, but look, I mean, look, you could, look, look. You could put coffee into an ice tray. You mean they freeze yeah. the, co- <laughs> the, the coffee? Ice... <laughs> no, no, they, I don't they, think they, they do that. The ice cubes can have like... Because look, there's, you can literally see it. There's like, Mine like are not solid like coffee on the inside. You see what I mean? Oh, no, no, look. That's Here's where it melts from. So like, if it melts like a crack... And then it goes into the Oh, cracks, it goes right? in, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah, that makes sense. What else is there to discuss here? Becky uh, stood up to her professor. Beck? Big moves, yo. Oh, yeah, yeah. Beck. Why did I say Becky? <laughs> Becky. Who the fuck is Becky, yo? It's like the regular Guinevere, word. bro. <laughs> Becky. Beck is her last name. <laughs> Guinevere, bro. <laughs> Guinevere, Becky. But yeah, she stood up to the professor like a G. Yeah. Told him the... G back? Told him... <laughs> to fuck off Yeah So Do you Yo, still think He's gonna go after The professor then? Maybe Like Joe? The, the professor like Probably like re- Retaliates or some well, shit Yeah I think he's gonna Retaliate Which he will you know So do, I Like I was thinking That she's celebrating Too early About beating the professor mm-hmm. Like she came all Like happy to Joe Got him a donut Started making out But maybe that's not The end of that story And that he has He's, he has something else up his sleeve. Maybe. That he's going to do, right? I mean, if he's that determined to get her out, like, he could just stage some next shit, right? Yeah. Like, he has bare power. So, I don't know. Damn, yo. But all I know is this is not going to be Joel's last kill. Like, he's going to kill bare people. From the looks of it. So you're on the street. So he's going to be a serial killer. Mm-hmm. Yeah, looks like it. And like yo, he, he like people that you just kill people like, you know what I mean? Like he he felt like unfazed, you know, about just catching a first body. He's just like fuck it, like. <clears throat> I think like it was more care, the fact know? that he knew what he had to do. Like there's no, there's mm-hmm. no other solution for that. I guess yeah. I mean, if you kidnap someone, 
They know your name. They know your motive. He's going to come back after you. Yeah. Like, no matter what, you have to do... Like, you would kill him. You'd want to kill your kidnapper. Right there yeah. and then. Yeah. Just, there's no there's no question about it, yo. He had to kill him. Yeah. Alright, guys. That was episode two of You. Make sure to leave a like. Comment down below your thoughts. And check out our Patreon page. Early access. Full reactions of this episode and all the coming episodes. Season one and two. Don't miss out. And we'll see you next episode. Peace. Thank you.